The following is a presentation of the Eagles Sports Network. Adam Cavalier alongside Carson Newman, head football coach Ken Sparks. Ken, congratulations. Go out winners today, 27-7, victors over Wingate, and the defense really shines through. I think uh, Wingate had the uh, – I think they had 61 yards at halftime. And, uh, you know, and that's the way you win championships right there. And that's what we've been talking about all year. I'm so happy for our defensive players and our defensive coaches <laughs> because I'm telling you, there's been a few times I've had to hide sharp objects from them, you know, to, <laughs> to keep them from hurting themselves because it has been a uh, tough year. Uh, and uh, But, you know, there's there's a way, you know, there's I'm so glad that the seniors got to experience a a complete football game Mm -hmm. because we hadn't experienced one all year. You know, the closest thing was, I guess, Mars Hill. Yeah. And so uh, to see, you know, to see something that they can end up with and say, you know, that was good because last week that was bad. And so to end up with something that says that's good, and I'm so grateful, you know, that we got to experience this experience today. The kids played. They had a lot of fun. And they played exceptionally well. And uh, so, uh, you know, I mean, you know, we still had too many penalties and we had two or three turnovers. <laughs> but uh, I told Sean Roston, you know, uh, at the end of the ball game, I said one for three is not bad. You know, he had two hit him right in the chest. And so, uh, but <laughs> – uh, but uh, what a great, what a great group of seniors! Twenty-five of them, boy. We we got some reloading to do in some places, and uh, so, but grateful for that group and their faithfulness and their investment in this program all these years, and and uh, just uh, glad to be a Carmen Newsom Eagle today. <laughs> you know, I'm just glad to be a, I'm glad to be an Eagle today, and uh, so. Uh, thank you, Lord, for blessing us like you like you have. What's that say that I mean? Playoffs are pretty much out of the picture, and uh, about the grand scheme of things in life, that you your team still fights uh, and, and puts together that complete performance that it's sought after all season. When really all that was on the line was second place in the sack. Yeah, I just uh, I think that was all about that was all about heart. And that's what we've been talking about all year, and I think we finally. Uh, I think our hearts were that big today, and I think that's you know that's what we've been talking about, and give them credit. You know, uh, I'd uh, I'd run out of things to say, so give them credit <laughs> because they're the ones that that uh, generated what they generated today. Let's talk about the defense. What was it? Was it strategy? Was it just effort that caused it to be so effective today? Well, I think it was a little bit of all of that. I think we had a good game plan. I think. Uh, uh, coaches did a great job. Uh, we we did something a little bit interesting this week. Uh, we substituted by unit. Mm-hmm. We went uh, uh, and you know, and we came up with these names. You know, the first uh, group that went in was the Titans. The second group that went in was the uh, Transformers. <laughs> and uh, so, uh, so we were hollering all week. We were hollering Titans and Transformers. You know, and. And we rotated defense all day with those two groups, and uh, they challenged each other, and I think they had a lot of fun with it, and it was it was really good. We finally got the chance to – we didn't have a chance. We just we just said early on we were going – on offense, we substituted uh, every other uh, series. On, on defense, we substituted every other series. And so uh, – we it's something that we're excited about having a bunch of kids have a chance to play and a whole bunch of seniors. We, we made sure that all the seniors played. Mm-hmm. And uh, <laughs> we, we, we had some interesting things to happen, but it was fun. It was fun to get that done. I thought Goose Manning was going to hand off to a lineman at I, some point. Goose <laughs> came off the field and said, JT, you're not supposed to take a handoff. You know, <laughs> so it was it was so funny, and uh, I don't know. I may to see the video. That may be one of those all time videos right there that'll go down in in Carson Newman history. It, that obviously you go into the off season with a good taste uh, in your mouths. How, how do you build on this for twenty fifteen? Well, the first thing we got to do is go recruit. Uh, if you got twenty five seniors, you better find some more that can come and play, and uh, so that's the top priority that we have and then you know we'll take uh, a month off and let them rest and let them heal and and then we'll come back in january ready to go we haven't talked about him yet andy hibbett uh 
great season as a whole, finishes with more four, with more than 1,400 yards uh, rushing for the year and moves past Brandon Baker and Antoine Oliver into sole possession of sixth place with 36 career rushing touchdowns. What's he meant uh, to this program over the last four years? Well, that's a congratulations to Andy, and uh, he's worked so hard and overcome injuries and all the things that uh, he means to this program. And Andy's the real deal, and I think he's kind of a – you know, he's one of the poster boys of Carson Newman football, and uh, so we're we're really proud of Andy. Ken, pleasure as always. Final thoughts on the 2014 season? Well, uh, it was uh, it was an interesting year. <laughs> and, um, it was uh, they, uh, you know, when I think back of my 35 years, uh, you know, I'll, I'll think back on this year and say, boy, they were some unbelievable highlights in my career. And then there were some unbelievable low lights, uh, you know, in, in the, the 35 years when I think about this year. So, uh, but it was a great year and and uh, grateful that the Lord has, um, you know, maybe planted seeds that these guys will uh, will reap on down the road and, uh, and, and some great things will happen. I can't wait to see what the Lord's going to do with some of these guys. It's going to be fun to watch. Ken, blast. Thanks for stopping by. Yes, sir. Thank you.